uh, it doesn't say it doesn't mean that this approach has nothing for us to worry about, especially for the students and teachers who are thinking about to try it、uh, at the very first time. There are more things for us to consider. The first thing you need to consider is、um, it takes time to become skilled.、Uh, I have seen in the past、uh, some teachers who are starting to use this method. What they did was.、Um, They didn't do any repetition for any sentence pattern. What they did is kind of like、um, they make a bunch of Google slides and just、uh, record themselves once for one slide. Then just goes one slide after another, and the speed is so fast the kids don't have time to answer those questions, and、uh, the picture can be confused and kids don't understand what is about. You know, so you have to really.、Uh, Look at how other people make those videos and make your own, and see students' response and go back to refine it. Gradually, along with the time, you are going to get better, more skilled. The second thing is always remember the best teachers, the best、uh, teachers for teachers are our students. Students' honest response and、uh, feedbacks. That's where we found our fix to make our contents better. The third thing is sharing videos on YouTube is always fun. Before I didn't really have time、uh, to upload my videos on YouTube, so mostly I just make those videos and save on my Google Drive or my computer drive. But like when the time when I have time to upload them on videos, I was shocked by how many views I got for video. You know, some of them I think my most viewed video is.、Uh, Close to ten thousand, you know, and that was like surprising. And although you see people who dislike your videos, but most people they like your video, and that feels very、uh, accomplishing.、Um, and number four, we need to take seriously is students may resist at first, since this is a new way of learning, and they may not accept it well, especially for older kids. Because、uh, older kids they have been learning language the traditional way, they want to know the structure, you know. But my younger kids, they are very、uh, acceptable to this approach, and、uh, they are not used to the grammatical grammatical structure method, and they like to figure things out by themselves. And、uh, you know, after watching those videos and finishing those questions, it's surprising to me like they know how to say things, and it's right there, you know. So, yeah. But as I said, for new kids who are new to this method. Uh, be prepared; they may not accept it well. And、uh, when my reference will be、um, the Star Talk program I attended in 2014 summer at University of Hawaii Manoa.、Uh, my trainer is Dr. Cynthia Ning, and、um, she was the first person who walked me through this approach systematically. Before, I was also a strong believer of. Showing kids video and they learn well from the videos, but my approach is more like you know make contents into fun nursery rhymes and let kids remember the nursery, let them sing, and then they transfer the contents into daily conversation. But Dr. Cynthia Ning, she really taught me the reason why we need to make videos because you know today they are 21st century learners, so they like to figure things independently. And、uh, and she also give us a lot of、uh, task.、Uh, hey, make a video about that topic. Make a video about that topic. And she really make it hands on and let us practice. And she taught me one thing very important, which is when you find authentic video, which you think is too hard for kids, change the task. Don't change the don't change the、uh, text. Change the task. So here, many thanks to.、Uh, Her, Doctor Cynthia Ning, and、uh, I think she will be really happy to know that I have been practicing this for six years now. Okay, and、uh, at the end, thank you, Guafo, for giving me the opportunity to、uh, give me the stage to share with my other colleagues about something I know, and I feel very humbled to have this chance to share with you、um, the area that ha- that I have been practicing. Okay, thank you, guys. Stay safe. And thank you, Vicky. Bye bye.